Hi, welcome to Next Light, Longmont's only 100% fiber internet provider. We're excited to have you join our Next Light community as you connect to one of the fastest internet services in the country. In this video, you'll learn how to activate your Next Light internet using our helpful self-install kit. Unboxing your self-install kit. First, let's see what's inside. This small black box is your ONT, or Optical Network Terminal. It connects you to the Nextlight fiber network. This yellow cable with green ends is the fiber jumper. It connects the ONT to a wall plate or media panel in your home. This power cord will connect your ONT to an electric outlet in your home. Finally, this Ethernet cable is used to connect your ONT to either your own Wi-Fi router or a router provided by Nextlight. You may or may not have a Nextlight router. If you do, it may look like this if you live in an apartment, or this if you're in a larger home. Or if you need extra coverage, you might have both routers. If you don't have a Nextlight router, it's a great way to help your high-powered connection reach all the wireless devices in your home. Just give us a call and we'll set you up. Now that you have everything, let's get started. Step one. First, look for a wall plate with the Nextlight logo in your kitchen, living room, bedroom, or basement. If you live in a single family home that has had Nextlight service before, it should look similar to this. If you can't find the wall plate or it appears to be damaged, you'll need to call one of our technicians to complete the installation. This is free of charge, and we can typically come within one business day. Call the phone number on the screen to get started. If you live in an apartment or townhome, your fiber internet connection is likely in a media panel that could be located in the kitchen, closet, or hallway. Again, if you can't find it or if it looks damaged, call us. Step two, once you've found your wall plate, take the fiber jumper and carefully remove the caps on each of the ends do not touch the cable ends once the caps have been removed. Plug the fiber jumper into the wall plate, making sure the notch on the green end aligns with the slot on the wall plate. You'll want to hold the green end of the jumper near the end and snap it in place until you hear it click. Step three, place your ONT and router near a power outlet and within reach of the fiber jumper that you've just connected. Avoid placing your router in a cramped or closed space, on a carpeted floor, or next to other electronic equipment, like a television, that might cause interference. Step four, ensure your ONT is ready for connection by removing the plastic cap on the green GPO in port. I'll take the yellow and green fiber jumper connected to the wall plate and connect it to the ONT. Again, make sure the notch on this end of the jumper is aligned to the slot on the fiber port and that the jumper snaps into place. Step five, plug one end of the provided power cord into the ONT and the other into an electrical outlet or power strip. You should see the ONT light up green. Step six, now we need to get your wireless set up. Pick up your Cat5e or 6 Ethernet cable. It should look like this. Plug it into the ONT's yellow port labeled Ethernet and connect the other end of the cable to the port on your router labeled WAN, Internet, or with a small globe icon. On our U6 router, the WAN port is the bottom white port. Next, plug one end of the provided power cord into the router and the other end into an electrical outlet or power strip you should see the router light up green. If you have your own Wi-Fi router, refer to the manufacturer's instructions to finish setting it up. Setting up your router can take up to five minutes. At the end, your router should be lit up and look like this. Step seven, locate your SSID and WPA. If you have a Nextlight router, the SSID and WPA key will both be on a sticker on your router. Then go to the Wi-Fi settings on your device. Turn on Wi-Fi and choose the SSID, which is the network name, and use the WPA key, which is the network password. Having one of our Nextlight Wi-Fi routers also lets you take advantage of our Nextlight Wi-Fi app on your phone or tablet. Simply download it to your phone or tablet from your preferred app store and select sign up and use any email address and password. 
With this app and our router, you can easily manage your home network while also ensuring that all your devices take advantage of Nextlight's speed and performance. Congratulations, you're online and ready to live at the speed of Nextlight. If you still have questions or need help, refer to our online app guide for more support at www.mynextlight.com slash Wi-Fi 6 support or call our tech support team at 303-774-4494, option two. And again, welcome to Nextlight.